Hi, in this video we are going to be talking about the windshield fluid not coming out uh, of uh, the reservoir. At the very beginning I would like uh, to ask you kindly to hit the button uh, super thanks if any of my videos helped you uh, solve uh, any issue on your car. There are three things we have to check here if uh, they are functional. The motor, the hose, as well as the nozzles. The motor, if it is working, the hose, if it is clogged, as well as the nozzles, which can also clog uh, over time. As for the motor, in order to check it, you must take it out of the washer reservoir, which is pretty straightforward. You will just have to take uh, your pliers and remove the hose clamp, pull the motor upwards, but be careful. If you do it uh, with your washer reservoir full of fluid, the fluid is going to start flowing out of the washer reservoir, so you will have to use some kind of a pump and drain the fluid out of the washer reservoir to the very bottom. Once you have done it, just pull out the motor and remove its connector. You will see the positive and the ground marked on the motor itself. Find some wire and apply 12 volts. And if you don't hear the motor working, then, well, I think you get the picture. If you made sure that your hose is not clogged, then you will have to check the nozzles, and for that purpose you will be needing compressed air. Remove the connector from the nozzles and apply air in order to unclog them, both from the lower as well as from the upper side. Don't be afraid, nothing can go bad. Get the connector back uh, and uh, do the same thing on the other side. Let's see what we have done. I'm happy with the result. So my dear ones, if you enjoyed this video, then please don't click uh, the button skip add. It is going to help me a lot. And till the next video, happy Mercedesing. Bye.